Today is the start of a new nine weeks, Falcons. Seniors are excited for their senior picnic. There's just so many activities coming up to look forward to. All this and more, FBN, FBN News, News starts, starts now. now. Good morning, Falcons. Today is Monday, November 1st. I'm Angelica Guerra. And I'm John Dees. Students, if you're interested in saving a life by donating blood, pass by the activities office to pick up your consent form. You have to be 17 or 18 years old to donate blood with parental permission. The blood drive will be taking place tomorrow and November 3rd during year 6 period. Seniors, senior picnic tickets are officially on sale today. They will continue to be on sale until today. Tickets are to be purchased on OSP only. Remember that only those that are cleared can purchase a ticket. Many events are in store for this school year. My co-anchor, Andrew, asked our students what they're looking forward to and how these events will be executed. With the school year in full swing, that means school activities are in session. Let's find out how the school will be executing these activities and what students are most looking forward to. What are some ways SGA is adhering to Miami-Dade COVID guidelines when planning these events? So we're going to be enforcing masks, social distancing, and having events outside. I'm definitely excited for the pep rallies just because like I'm an MC, so I know me and my friends are gonna definitely like have a good time. We're gonna bring great energy and just like you know like have a good memory senior year. I'm most looking forward to grad bash and graduation because four years later finally. I think I'm looking forward to the pep rallies because since we missed out on last year, we get to like experience that again. This year seems to be filled with lots of fun. Falcons, remember to participate. You won't want to miss out. I'm Angelica Guerra reporting for FBN News. Good morning, Falcons. I'm Annabella Diaz with Fear Weather. Today is the start to some nice cold fronts with it being 66 degrees. You can expect a high of 82 degrees and a low of 64 degrees. At this missile, this weather should continue. So make sure to pack a jacket and remember to keep a sunny attitude, Falcons. What's up, Falcons? I'm Vimeli Salgado with your club news. Close-up club is meeting today in room 309 after school. TV club, if you're attending J-Day, don't forget to pass by Ozone's room to get your field trip form for Friday. And remember, stay involved, Falcons. Hey, Falcons. I'm Adriana Castellano, see for your sports news. Our Falcons football team will be taking on Westland Hialeah this Thursday, November 4th at 3.30 p.m. on the Ferguson Field. Falcons, make sure to wear black to black out the field. Listen, boys, if you're interested in trying out for the basketball team, today, November 1st, will be the last day to try out. Good luck to everybody that's trying out. And have a marvelous Monday, Falcons. Hi, Falcons. I'm Javier Francesi with your entertainment news. Doing the big screen adaption of the influential sci-fi novel, generated 15.5 million in the second week of release. The companies behind Dune have already announced that Tim Timothy Chalamet, Oscar Isaac, and Zendaya will return to Arrakis for a sequel. That's all the news I have for you. Take it easy, Falcons. John, I got my ID, but it doesn't even have my senior picture on it. Are you serious? To be honest, I don't even think I have my ID on me. John, when are you going to finally follow school rules? Well, luckily, Javi made us a little video that I can probably learn from. Let's cut to the video right now. <laughs> 